which I saw a little bit earlier. It should be a good match. I think Prado won the first one. Let's see if Belicia Emanuel can make any adjustments to swing this match in her favor this time. May Prado with, with a collar. Belicia has the wrist changed off to an underhook. Prado circles away from it. Both girls hand fighting. Club. Overtime by Prado. Both of them looking for wrist control on the other side. Belicia gets it. Passes the elbow off. Belicia with the wrist and collar. Goes to an underhook. As they call for passivity red with one minute left in this first period. Some level change by Prado. Underhook by Prado. Both of them uh, over-unders, 50-50 position. Belicia looked like she's trying to pull that arm in. Oh, underarm spin by Prado. Crawfish is through, doesn't quite get it. She needed to pull a little bit farther. We got 30 seconds on. We got one point manual. Prado was on the clock. <clears throat> we got 20 seconds left. Prado takes a look at the clock. He knew something was coming. She looks for a drag. Tries to circle behind. Countered well by Belicia. She gets to a double, a body lock and throws it by. For two takedowns, it goes up three to zero with five seconds left in the first period. Looks like those adjustments were made. So Belicia Emanuel goes into the break with a 3-0 lead over May Prado from Georgia. When she got to her body lock, she didn't hesitate. She just stepped up and threw it by. See if May Prado from Georgia picks it up the second round. As Brock Zollinger brings him back to the center, he's one of the best refs, in my opinion, in the country. And he starts him off. Here we go, the second period. Collar by Prado. Another underhook by Belicia Emanuel. So both of them are fighting for position. Now she, they're both over-unders, which I think favors Belicia Emanuel, even though it's a 50-50 position. Oh, and she gets a knee tap and drops her for two takedown and goes up five to zero, 30 seconds into the second period. Faking a, a cross face and faking down to a leg lace. The referee calls him back up. 5 0 Belicia Manuel over May Prado. Drag attempt by Prado. Stuff and right back to her underhook and then double unders to a body lock. Pulls out of it. Prado getting busier with her hands. Tries to slide by. Keeps sliding, 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 sliding. Ends up in a Merkel position. Got to clear her leg to get their points. Belicia's sitting on it, so she can't clear it. I don't think she's going to get her leg out. She's trying desperately to get it out. She's even posting on her back to try to slide and limp a glout as the referee stops it, brings it back to the center with 42 seconds left in this second period. Both of them talking for head position, grinding their noggins together. Club by Belicia Emanuel. Prado with an overtie. Slide by attempt. Doesn't quite get it. Belicia playing, playing, I wouldn't say safe. 
Trying to clear that underhook. Posting on the elbow pit, pushing it down. Goes back to her body lock. Inside, or outside trip for four. Wow, what a change of points. So that makes it nine to zero as time runs out in this period. What a turnaround. Unless I'm incorrect, Prado won the first match and then loses the second one, nine to zero. So we're gonna see a third match at 65 kilograms at U17 for the national title. Wow, they made some adjustments. Next match is, in my opinion, the toughest girl in the U17.